President Biden's plan to erase student loan debt for millions of Americans remains tied up in the legal system. The case is now in the hands of the Supreme Court justices. NBC's Bree Jackson is in Washington, D.C. And Bree, some justices appeared skeptical of the president's plan. Good morning, Maureen. After several hours of oral arguments, some justices question whether President Biden's plan to forgive student loan debt is legal. Other justices question whether the challengers even have the right to sue. Student debt has got to go. Hey, hey. A showdown at the Supreme Court. The financial future of millions with student loan debt on the line. It definitely weighs on my mind. I made the decision, the financial decision for myself, to go to the university where I would have the least amount of debt. The high court heard arguments Tuesday over President Biden's student debt forgiveness plan. It would erase up to $10,000 for people earning less than $125,000 per year and up to $20,000 for Pell Grant recipients. Conservative justices, they're skeptical. Along comes the government and tells that person, uh, you don't have to pay your loan. Liberal justices, question whether the challengers, six Republican-led states and two people with student loan debt, even have the legal standing to sue and express sympathy for debt holders. They don't have friends or families or others who can help them make these payments. The evidence is clear that many of them will have to default. Part of the argument, the president overstepped his authority by taking action without congressional approval. Lawmakers are divided. The president's student loan giveaway will do nothing, nothing to address the root of the problem, and that is soaring college costs. In fact, it's likely to make things worse. 90% of the relief going to out of school borrowers will go to those earning less than $75,000 a year. This is not some giveaway to the rich, that's utter bull. The High Court is expected to rule on the matter by the end of June. And the Congressional Budget Office estimates that President Biden's plan to forgive student loan debt would cost more than $400 billion. Wow. Maureen. And Bree, how many people will be affected by this ruling? Well, so far, it's expected to affect 40 million Americans. That's cur current as well as former students. So a lot at stake here. All right, Bree Jackson will be paying attention to this live in D.C. for us. Thank you so much.